Welcome, I'm the Word Nerd, and this is Counting the Cost Ministries. Let's dig deeper. So today, we're going to go over May's Faith Bullet Journal setup. So this month, I didn't have time to actually record me doing this, how to kind of do this on the go, but I still wanted to upload and hopefully encourage or inspire someone to journal their journey with God too. So, so this month, I did the verse page on Psalms 119, 103. So it's, How sweet are thy words unto my taste, ye sweeter than honey to my mouth. So my theme is honeycomb, or like a bee theme, I guess. Uh, although I didn't draw any bees, I just drew the honeycomb. So a uh, honeycomb, and I felt it uh, pretty, pretty relevant. So, um, yeah, that's the first page and May title page, so cover page, title page, um, May. So, so I drew the hexagons and then colored them in and I used a few different sizes. So this size is actually this top one right here. Got these stencils from wish.com, pretty cheap. Um, and then I just colored them in with three different color yellows of Crayola. Crayola super tips and found a way to kind of blend without uh, them bleeding through so I did a little bit of bleed through from when I was trying to blend the May part um, but I did this first and then did these so I kind of figured it out uh, with the three markers how to blend it before it gets too bad so there's no other real bleeding um, it's only this little few places so it worked out so this is my monthly log of May um, so the calendar are hexagons and I didn't want to color them in because I write on them and highlight and things so but I did color each around it and I kind of used the colors the four different yellow colors I had um, I also used uh, this lightest color of Tombow yellow, which is 062, um, to do the first layer of writing of May and honey and, you know, May over here as well. But colored these, and I think it came out, I like it, uh, it came out pretty good. Um, so this is where I put in my, what I read throughout the day or every day so and then I thought of this um early past few days I guess I can't remember when exactly but I wanted to record what my mood I guess you could call this a mood tracker or something like that um to see how my reading habits change with my current mood and what I'm going through and so these are the four that I have I might add another one um but I'm not sure, so we'll see uh, how how it goes if I think of something else or I'm in a different mood than these. <laughs> um, so the next is over here, and it's my music section. I have this every month. I like to record the music that I listen to because it can tell you about what season that you're in. Um, so have that, and then this is video ideas or videos that I want to get done. Uh, in this month so i still gotta write those down um but yeah so this is the big meat of my setup pretty much um so i use this bigger hexagon on this one for the um right here for the dates and then um the smallest one on this one right there uh for these little ones and i color these in because it wasn't a lot and I think it came out really good um, I probably could have maybe left the space blank or, or just filled more maybe with these in but I'm trying to save some space I'm more than halfway done with this notebook and I want to try to let it last as long as possible so <laughs> that's that's that so so the next page is words and so these are words that God gives me and I define them. Uh, this is a very important part of my journal. I'm a word nerd and words and definitions 
are my thing and that's how God talks to me and so this is a definitely has to be in my setup and so I did some like medium hexagons on this one this medium one right here and kind of just scattered them around and put them in clumps and I think it will do really well because I'll be able to do the words and definitions in between them and yeah I just think it came out really good I did the same um, ombre effect on this and blended on these and I think it came out great so I'm pretty excited about it so that's the end let's just do a quick flip through real quick So let's do a quick flip through of April. So this was April's cover and verse page. And this was videos and music and the calendar. And this was the words page. So yeah, hope you enjoyed. I'm the Word Nerd and this is Counting the Cost Ministries. Make sure you check me out on Instagram. It's right here and see what I'm up to and studying on a more frequent basis. You can come ask me questions and chat with me there. Uh, yeah, hope you enjoyed, and I'll talk to you soon. Remember, God loves you, and he's always with you. God bless.